the most popular farmhouse beers in Belgium. It's beer o'clock and from Brasserie Dupont in Hainaut, Belgium, we have a bottle of their Saison Dupont coming in at 6.5% ABV. Now a little bit about Saison beers. Um, Saison is basically means farmhouse beer. Now what these were designed for originally was very easy brewed beer, sort of one hop, one grain, um, simple beers that are brewed that basically the people that worked on the fields, worked in the farms, after they finished work would get given like a couple of bottles or a couple of glasses of this beer and at the end of the day like, and they're all meant to be sort of light, fruity, refreshing, um, basically what, what the workers on the farms needed at the end of the day. Um, now there's around 20 saisons brewed in Belgium now um, on the market and Sort of 30 years ago, the, the style nearly died a death. People weren't buying it anymore, and it wasn't the, the vogue beer to have at the time. And it's sort of now making a very big comeback. But when these beers were originally brewed, they were all about sort of 2 to 3%. Um, as you know, this one is going to be 6.5%. So it's, it's, it's probably sort of double what um, the original sort of Saisons were. Um, now, Saison Dupont was first brewed in 1844. And uh, we'll crack it open and we'll give it a go and we'll take it from there, eh? So that is basically everything you needed to know about Saisons but were afraid to ask. So let's get this in a glass. Got a bit lively towards the end. There we go. It's hazy, it's got a beautiful three finger head on there. Um, lots of carbonation. Should we get the aromas? Without getting the foam on my nose. Yeah, it's fruity, it's really, really peppery. You know, the hint of pepper coming through here. Yeasty, peppery. Some sweet malts there. Yeah, it really does smell like a cracking beer. And you can just see by the colour of it, you know, you know it's going to be good, you know, especially when it pours ahead like that. Um, we'll just dive in, cheers. Very, very fruity, with a nice sort of pepper clove, subtle taste going through it. Um, you can't really smell the cloves when you, you put it up to your nose, but you can taste the cloves definitely through the beer. Very light bitterness on the finish. Um, lovely sort of lingering aftertaste of sort of this fruitiness. Um, I'm possibly tasting some sort of pear in there. Um, you seem to be getting more more taste on this beer after you've taken a sip, believe it or not. Um, yeah, it's, it's for a simple beer, it's very, very good. Um, 
laces the glass well, it's keeping the head well. There's no sweetness there. The malts, it's a very, yeah, it's a light bitterness and it's constant throughout, throughout the beer. Um, and at this back end is where you're getting, you tend to get the most flavours after you've swallowed the beer. Um, very, very good. It's a nice example of a Saison. Um, it's also one of them beers, is once you get in more and more sips of it, getting more and more different flavours on your mouth. Um, I'm getting sort of a, a doughiness, like fresh dough sort of taste now. Um, sort of freshly, freshly baked bread. Uh, yeah, all in all really, really good. Um, very, very good example, like I said, very, very good example of a Belgium Saison. If you haven't tried a Belgium Saison before, um, this is possibly the one to try. Um, it's it's a good example. Now, I know that lots of craft beer places are doing Saisons now, you know, you've had Brew Dog do them and various others, but you can't beat the original because the Belgians, they know how to brew beer. And, yeah, Look, go and get yourself a bottle, try it, see what you think. Uh, I got this from um, um, Beautiful Beers in Bury St Edmunds, but you can get it online and that, you know. Um, yeah, buy a bottle, see what you think, leave a comment in the box below, give us a thumbs up, hit that little bell, you'll get notified every time I bring out a new uh, video. And as always, subscribe to the channel and share away and tell all your mates and that, because without the subscribers, the channel is nothing. And uh, as I always say, beer is the answer, but I cannot remember the question. Thank you for watching. Good night.